Hi, my name is Jasper. In this video, I will show you how to create and bake a vector displacement map and how you can create in 5 minutes ahead with these maps. First of all, you have to download this version of Blender. I will leave a link in the description. And then you have to download these blend files, one for testing and one for baking. Vector displacement maps or VDM allows you to create complex displacements that can have overhang, like ears, nose and horns. It is really important to start with the plane, because we need the square UV, so do not remesh it or do the retopology. Here I start subdividing the plane. With this model I will create a nose. I will start blocking out the main shape and then I will add subdivision. In sculpt mode I will use mainly the grab brush. Once I reach a readable shape of the nose, I'm going to add the multi res modifier. In this way I can add more details. Once I finish the model, I will open the VDM baking setup blend file previously downloaded with the Blender 3.5 alpha version. When you open the file, you will find a sample mesh. And you can reduce the multi res modifier to see how the asset is done. I'm going to append the nose model. To bake the map, assign the material, select the model and select the image texture node in the shader editor. Create a new texture, then you name it and then you can check 32 float bit. And so again, select the model, select the image texture and then you press bake. Now save the texture and save it in the open EXR file format. With the same blend file, you will have to open the other VDM blend file. In this file, you will find the sphere with a multi res modifier. As a personal preference, I prefer to apply a subdivision modifier before using a multi res modifier. Before I subdivide the mesh with a multi res modifier, I just want to block out the head. If you open the right file, in sculpt mode under the draw brush, you will find this texture. This is the sample brush and these are horns. I will delete this map and I will use the one I've made before. Here I made 4 maps, ear, nose, mouth and eye. I grab the nose map and in front view I try to align to the center. I click and drag. And this is actually really nice because with one click I just made the nose. Now I will do the eyes. I select the map and then I just click and drag. The next is the mouth. This one is too big so I will do a small one but as you can see it's actually pretty easy. I just fix a little bit the head shape and then I will do the ears. There are sometimes still some mistakes as you can see here but with a smooth brush I will clean everything. And to finish it I will just use the horns. The cool thing about this is finally we have this in Blender. And you can create your own assets based on your style and you can improve your workflow. I will upload the 4 maps I've made on my Gumroad page. I will leave the link in the description. 
I hope this video was helpful, if so, leave a comment and a like, uh, it will really help me with the algorithm. See you in the next video.